gonna show you how to get this fake nails DIY at home for under six dollars. Yes, I said under six dollars. I got this at Walmart, and this is what the package looks like. And I use this polish, pure ice. And if you want to know how to get it, um, just stay tuned and watch the video. This is what the nail kit looks like. Hopefully, you guys can see. Um, basically, it's the Kiss Hundred Nails. Full cover nails. Okay, these are not the nail tips. A lot of people on YouTube are using the nail tips, which is not for full coverage. It's basically just for your tips, like when you go to the nail salon and everything like that. This is going to be the, it says Active Square. They have an oval one too. And it looks like they're kind of small. They're not really, you know, like claw-like or anything like that. And it says bonus uh, plus 100 nails. It comes with the nail glue and holds polish and nail art for lasting wear. So I already um, pushed my cuticles back using my cuticle pusher remover. I'm going to put some polish remover on my nails right now. And I got this from Walmart too. It's a pure ice in 968. And does it say the color? It's absolutely marvelous. So, this is what the color looks like. I thought it'd be nice for fall. And that's what it looks like. So, hopefully, my camera is showing this beautiful color. And then I got a top coat, which I had for a long time, simple colors, and it's just a clear top coat. Okay, so I'm just going to apply some um, polish remover onto my nails, just to get rid of any remaining polish on um, nails. Okay, let's see. And my nails are so brittle right now. It's ridiculous. I think it's the pregnancy and um, vitamins and everything like that that I've been taking. Or maybe I need more vitamins. So I'm going to clean it as much as I can. Like I said, my nails are very brittle. Um, I got literally layers coming off of my nose. So let's see if you can see. But like this one, I think you can really see that, but they're very brittle, they're super thin, and they were longer in the beginning of the pregnancy, but now they're just super short. And they break, literally, they were like up to here. They are really long. Next thing, I know I gotta prep my nails, um, finally them, but let's see what the directions say. And the directions oops, are actually on the back, which is good. It says, prep, clean your nails with acetone polish remover. Select the correct nail size, each finger if needed. Gently file each side for best fit. So, it tells you just to prep the nails. Okay, so I'm going to just file them because when you file your nails, um, it stays on a lot longer, so... There's two sides for this. There's like a little buffing side, and then the actual nail file. I'm just gonna use the buffing side. So I'm gonna get rid of this extra a nail that just hang, not hanging there, but just the brittleness, so it can be really nice and smooth. And just make sure you file the whole nail. I don't have my tripod with me. It broke, or this could have been. A lot better, like my other nail video that I have up. So, there you go. So, I'm gonna go through the whole nail, all the nails, and I'll get back to you. Okay, so now that I'm done, there's a lot of mess. Um, Finally, in my nails, and as you can see, buffing them. I'm gonna go back again with the 
polish remover and just remove the dust and this is going to help to remove any oils from your nail beds that's why you file your nails and put polish remover or acetone next thing is if you file too much or too harsh on your nails they're gonna burn sometimes when you go to the salon they use a um, oh, I think I have it with me they use a drill a nail drill and you know they really don't know um, you know how sensitive your nails are I mean they should see I mean if your nails are very thin not to go deep or over drill them but sometimes they do and once they clean them it burns and then hopefully your nails come out right so I kind of followed them down like I said um, the brittleness on the tip part so directions apply nail glue okay so first first um, I forgot I need to pick out my nails right okay I don't want to like over open this up it's like over open this up I don't want to like rip it okay and the directions for the directions to the side well this it's a clear case and let's pick out some nails let's do my pinky first oh, it's still dust everywhere okay let's try this side and they do have numbers on them this one says number six I don't know if you guys can See that what it says number six. Hey guys, so I am back and I polished my nails like I said with this pure ice and absolutely marvelous color. Okay, so they came out really nice. They look like I got them done at a salon, right? I only paid around five dollars for this, so it's like five dollars and some change, so like six dollars for this kit. And I don't know, I like them. Let's see if they're going to last a week or more. I heard the Kiss Polish work, I mean Kiss Polish, the Kiss Nail Glue works really good. So let's see. And usually when I do my fake nails, um, in the past, I haven't done it this year, maybe like last year or a couple years back, I, I swear, I feel like only one nail probably breaks because I did not um, put the nail on right because maybe bubbles or anything like that. But usually they stay on so long, I'm like ripping them off. So hopefully this stays on long, and then maybe I can like um, repolish them, hopefully. And that is pretty much it. So if you guys are a beginner um, to do your nails, and you just wanted to save some money and everything like that, go ahead and go try this. I mean, you've seen, it's a little bit difficult for me trying to do it, but it actually came out really nice. And usually for the way it looks like right now, I mean, it looks pretty decent, you know, because I put the top coat on and usually I probably would have paid, you know, somebody to do my nails, which I could have did at home. So pretty much, and this is what it looks like. So does the nails match? Probably does. And this one was a little bit, um, this nail polish was a little bit thick as well. So... Hopefully, that looks pretty cute, right? 